Hey, Dr. Shelley again from 360 Sports Medicine and Spine Therapy. Here to drop you a little more info on how to address those aches and pains in your neck and shoulders, and particularly your upper back, because we know you're hurting there. If you give us a like and a subscribe down below, you'll be getting information and notifications about all the content that's coming your way. So let's get started. So your spine has some normal curvature. So normal curve is the anterior curve in the neck and low back, and then a posterior curve in the mid back. So if I sit like this, you can see nice and straight, get a little curvature through my middle back, get that neck in line, and bring my pelvis forward and sit up nice and tall. We all know everybody's sitting and hurting these days, uh, working in not ideal situations. So I wanted to drop you some tips on what you can do at home that will help with some of those aches and pains. So I have next to me kind of a variety of uh, handy tools. So these are readily available on the internet. Um, we love Rock Tape. They sell some of our favorite ones. Um, but anywhere that you can get some good uh, neck softballs is helpful to get some of these pains under control. So first is this biggest kind of squishy ball. So if I lay down on this, this is handy. I can just lay down, support my head, and relax over it. That lets me kind of open up that chest after I've been working on folks all day or sitting at my desk doing mind-numbing paperwork. I'd rather work with you folks. But this one feels nice, especially if you have a lot of aches and pains. This is really comfortable. But when you have those specific trigger points, those are real sore spots in places where you have inflammation and tissue, not necessarily tissue damage, but t some tissue dysfunction happening. So those are the places you hit where you get a little lump, it's extra sore. That's where one of these two things can be real helpful. So this one is a fixed peanut, we call it. And then this one actually opens up a little bit. So they're both handy. I'm going to show this one first. So if I get this on my lower thoracic spine, so your thoracic spine is where your ribs hit. So it's pretty stiff. And a lot of times we see people run into trouble because their thoracic spine is so stiff that the problem goes down to the low back or up to the neck. So keeping that thoracic spine mobile helps with your shoulders, helps with your neck, helps with your low back. So just kind of moving, taking a little deep breath over that peanut, relaxing back, doing that a few times when you hit a spot that feels extra yucky is real helpful. So that is nice for the peanut. And then we get into more fun tools, the vibration ball. So this one shakes. So when you're, the shaking, the vibration is extra helpful when you have something that feels real hot. Just hang on there. That's a good spot right there. Just hang on there and it will settle that down. Uh, I like to hear my voice on that one. And that way it'll help inhibit some of that tension. It'll break down where and why some of that stuff is tight. And it inhibits your, even your pain fibers from going crazy. It provides some overload of information and causes your system, your neurophysiological system to dampen down. So with those few tips, you can get some good relief from your discomfort just from things that will fit in a little shoe box in your house. So tune in for more tips. Remember to hit the like and subscribe down below and we'll keep bringing it. Have a great day.